Welcome back to the channel. I am Chai and I am back here today with you for another Disney Dreamlight Valley video. I'm showing you how to make all the recipes from the appetizers in the Rift in Time expansion pass through Eternity Isle. If you would like to see the other two videos on the appetizers that I have done, you can go check them out in the playlist in the description below. If you go to the collections tab and make sure you are on the Eternity Isle tab and then go over to meals, you will see there are 20 23 new appetizers. In the first video, we did arepas con queso through coleslaw. The second video, we did conch ceviche through royal iced tea. This video, we are going to be showing you the royal latte all the way through and finishing off the appetizers through the vegetarian dumplings. I'm going to be doing a lot of these. I'm going to the appetizer section. I'm going to be doing a lot of these, automatically filling them and then telling you what is in them. The first appetizer that we're going to do is the royal latte that contains milk and majesty majesty can be found here in eternity isle and milk obviously is through a quest that you get through unlocking remy the next recipe is royal tea which you just need majesty for majesty can be found in the overlook and the ruins area in the ancient landing the next recipe that we are making is the sandworm carpaccio plate, which requires a sandworm and melon. That looks very scary to me. Uh, I don't want to eat something that has teeth coming out of it. No, thank you. The next recipe here we have is called shad ceviche. It is made with shad, onion, tomato, and lemon. The next recipe is the spicy scorpion skewer that is made with one scorpion and paprika. That's also scary. <laughs> Some of these recipes are scary to me. I, if this was put in front of me on a plate, I would probably turn around and say, I'm going to eat somewhere else. No, thank you. Our next recipe is takoyaki stick, which is an octopus, seaweed, eggs, and soya. Soya is found in the milk category. It's very dark to see, but to me, it looks like bonbons with icing. The next recipe is thousand needles. You need a brilliant blue starfish, a pretty pink starfish, and cacto berries. Cacto berries can be found around in the glittering dunes, and the pink and blue starfish are found only in the oasis, which is pretty much in the glittering dunes. It's like the only grassy area there, but it is found in the water. Both of those are found interchangeably in the orange fishing circles. Next recipe is tomato basil soup, a nice simple one. You just need basil and tomato. Both which come from the Dreamlight Valley. And the last recipe for the appetizer section is vegetarian dumplings. You need soya, wheat, and any vegetable. Don't mind if I do, I will take those any day of the week. We have finished off the appetizer section of the new recipes in Eternity Isle. In the very next video, I will be starting off doing the entrees. If you have any feedback or suggestions, please leave them in the comments below and also subscribe if you enjoyed the video so you won't miss any new content from me in the future. Until next time, have a wonderful day.